Have you ever had a passion? Something that you love so much that you just have to share with the world. And you don't even know if the world is gonna see it, but you love it so much you don't care? Well... It's the Muppet Show with our very special guest star, Mr. Steve Martin! When I was about one and a half years old, my parents showed me something called the Muppets. Yeah those guys. Let me just tell you, when I say I fell in love with the Muppets, I mean it. Dude, I'm not playing around. I got three-year-old proof of me drawing Kermit the Frog like, oh, let me show you. Oh my gosh, why does it, why is his foot like that? I also have a talent, as you could clearly tell by three-year-old me. Yeah, that guy. A couple of days ago, I sat down and I said, I want to start a project. Well, that doesn't usually end well because half the time I don't finish my projects. But I think this one can actually get maybe finished. I don't know. I I'm not making any guarantees, but my plan is to have a series of me drawing all the Electric Mayhem members. So far, it's looking good because I have two drawings done on it. Yeah, big deal, buddy. Alright. They're good drawings. They're good. They're good drawings. They're, They're good drawings. So I think it's fitting because, you know... Depending on when this comes out, you know, there's the Electric Mayhem show that came out like two months ago called Muppets Mayhem, but yeah. As you should know, if you're watching this video, the lead member of the Electric Mayhem is Dr. Teeth. Obviously based on Dr. John, who sadly passed away recently. He, he kind of looks like this, so if my drawing ends up looking somewhat like this at least i guess you know it's a good drawing but without further ado let's get into the speed paint all right so i'm just gonna take y'all through my process so first of all to start off i'm just gonna say i don't really do a sketch yep you heard me right i don't do a sketch i don't know why i just don't it doesn't really help me when I'm drawing humans, I can understand why people use a sketch, and a lot of times when I am drawing humans, I do do that. But, I don't know, for a character so simple as a Muppet, I don't think that a sketch is necessary. I don't know quite how to explain it, but it just comes naturally for me. I just start off with a black line, I use a brush called dry ink, and if you were wondering what program I use, which is a question that you might be asking, I use a program on my iPad called Procreate. Procreate is what I use for all my drawings, and also that animation that you saw in the beginning. His fingers were super fun to draw, I mean super fun to draw. I don't know why I like drawing hands, most people don't like drawing hands. I have a lot of unpopular opinions when it comes to my artwork, I just realized. But yeah, basic line art. I'll come back to you when I start the coloring. Eh, that wasn't so long. Anyway, I have my own color palette that I use for most of my drawings. And yeah, that's what I'm using currently for this as well. For my coloring, I use a brush called Studio Pen. And I think it just works very well for most of the things that I try to convey in my art. You know, I've always found art just fun. It's something that I can do, something that I enjoy, and something that I can express my emotions with. Guys, art is amazing. You should try it out. Call 1-800-555-66349 to get started today. That's not a real number. Please don't call it. Um, anyway, 
Now you can see here I'm adding the stripes to his shirt, as that is something that his shirt has. Wow! I actually wrote that. It's like people don't have eyes. I'm sorry if you're a blind person watching this video. I hope I didn't offend you. Well, I'll get back to you when I start the shading. Bye! I lied. I'm back, baby. Okay, I gotta explain something here. As you can clearly tell, some of the keys are currently gray, which are the ones that are right underneath his fingers. My original idea was to have them gray because he was obviously pressing down on them, but eventually I ended up not liking how that looked, so I changed it. Anyways, bye. I'll see you back at the shading. Mike cut out there. Anyways, now for real, I'm gonna go see y'all back at the shading. Again, that wasn't so long, was it? Anyway, as you can see here, I just, well, I was being lazy. There were two options here. I could have put a lot of effort into matching the colors and making a darker version for every single stripe, or I could just put a layer above it on low opacity and color in black. Yeah, I chose the latter. But that's okay, because I only did that for the arms and the vest. The rest, I hand colored. Yay! Anyways, guys, I'm gonna see y'all back when this is done. Guys, it's done! My first video on YouTube. Thank y'all. Thank y'all very much for watching till the end. I'm very happy with how this art piece turned out, and I love the Muppets. Praise the Lord. Goodbye.